everybody. So glad you're with us. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to Chicago and the famed Aragon Ballroom for tonight's main event. Ten rounds in the welterweight division. This should be a really good matchup here tonight. All that energy that we saw it almost boiled over at the weigh-in yesterday. Now it gets to explode here in the ring. His adversary, his professional record, stands at 26 victories, including 11 knockouts and no losses so far. Jim, Desert Storm, Bradley! All right, gentlemen, protect yourselves at all times. Let's touch them up. get a fight like this that everybody's been talking about. It's always so interesting to see these opening moments here in round number one. Dismisses his opponent's headshot. Holt's done a good job there offensively scoring with that left hand. Worst of body, kid. That's right. Body shots. Body shots. How do you define consistency when you describe the fact that among this matchup you're looking for guys to be more consistent? Which guy's going to be more consistent? How do you define that? Just in one area. When they get inside, for example, Joe, every once in a while somebody takes a little bit of a break. Yeah, there's working, but all of a sudden one guy's arm goes behind the other guy. I'm looking to see who keeps both hands free. Crashes home with the uppercut. Nice job there hooking to the body. Halfway through round number one. Keep moving. You've got to see that coming now. Come on. Well, that was his intention, and that's what he's doing. Not engaging in the fight, but clinching. And makes that nice right angle on that hook upstairs. Look at that. The hook came home with ease. Oh, and they decide to trade there. He's committed to the combination punching now. It's working out well up top. Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. Red hot action to open up this fight. Both men throwing, both men landing. It's been a long time since I've seen something like this. I think it was in a film like Remy. Watchman Hammer and Hank, the great Henry Armstrong. Never took a step backwards, kept going forward. Bradley's right hand did a nice job that time. That worked well for him. Right on the mark with the hook up top. So they close out that round. Joe and Teddy with you ringside. Teddy, I know you watch uh, very closely how these trainers go about their business. You were under the tutelage of one of the true legends of the game, the great Customato. Yeah, I mean, I was fortunate. Quite honestly, those opportunities, situations, probably don't exist anymore because we've lost a lot of those you know, really great trainers and managers that boxing was their whole life. I spent seven years with Customato, and I learned the nuts and bolts from a physical, technical point of view of what's important to give to a fighter, but the psychological part, to understand the pressures that a fighter is under, the fears that a fighter deals with. And if you don't understand that, all the other things don't mean anything, because you have to understand how a fighter is feeling to understand why he's behaving or not behaving a certain way. Keep it up. You can Keep see he's up. trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Well targeted two punch combo by Holt. Crafty counter punching. Oh boy, big shot up top. Teddy, I don't think he's got visions of sticking around too long. He's landed power punches early. Yeah, he wants to make it a quick night's work. Teddy, among the things that we should be looking for early is which fighter can show a wide array of an offense. Yeah, you don't want to always be coming in that front door all the time. You want to come in the side door every once in a while, you know. Sometimes you want to maybe even come through the roof, down the chimney. You want to mix it up. Halfway through round number two. Needs to improve that accuracy, miss with the headshot. Come on, keep working the body, keep working the body. 
Tim Bradley's right hand working well that time. He scored well. You see, he sits and waits and then strikes with that counter punch by the hole. Wow! He was just bulldozed right there. One punch knockout power ends this fight. He's able to come up with a shocker here. Out of nowhere, early on, a knockout victory. And does it with one shot that he never saw. That does it from ringside. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Thanks for being with us.